you're probably familiar with Google's search engine. In fact, it's likely you use Google on a daily basis for personal, professional, and academic reasons. But you might not be familiar with the advanced search offered by Google. Google's advanced search allows users to have more control over their searches to find more pertinent websites and documents. For example, you're researching the history of the Long Island Railroad but are having trouble finding relevant sites using just the basic search. After you've done this initial search in Google, you'll notice a box in the top right-hand corner with a gear icon on it. If you click on this, you'll find several search settings, including a link to the advanced search. Here you are given multiple boxes to mix and match your keywords so you can structure your search better to find better results. The first box is where you'll type all the keywords that are important and need to be in the results. The second box allows you to search for important keywords as phrases, requiring that the words must be found next to each other. The third box is where you might include a variety of synonyms or related terms that will help narrow your search but are far less important than the keywords typed above. Although all of these words may be in a result, only one of them it needs to be. In the fourth box, you can type keywords to help exclude certain types of information. Perhaps you keep finding information on current Long Island Railroad schedules. To avoid this, you could type schedules in the box. Next, Google Advance provides a way to look for a range of numbers, which could be measurements, dollar amounts, dates, etc. As a reminder, Google provides basic definitions and examples to the right of each box. Below the boxes are ways to narrow your Google search further. You can choose the language of a site, select sites published in certain areas, only choose sites updated within a certain time frame, and much more. One tool that works particularly well is the site or domain limiter. This will limit your results to only certain types of sites, like government.gov, educational.edu, organization, Dot org, commercial.com, or any other of your choosing. Government and educational sites tend to provide some of the best academic information on the web, so you may want to limit your search to one or both of them. Now when you click search in Google Advance, you'll see a big difference in the results found. Notice that your advanced search has been put into the basic search box. Remember to always check websites and documents for scholarship, accuracy, and reliability. If you need help finding a reputable website or using the Google Advanced Search, please ask a reference librarian.